HKM News Director Tom Nappy here, and I am joined by Pat Mahan and Michael Girardi. And uh, this Saturday is the Live for Evan 5K. Can you talk about what the 5K is about? Yes, Tom. The 5K is our big annual fundraiser um, whereby we raise funds um, to use us to uh, support our cause through the, through the year. All right. And can you talk about uh, what's going to take place here at the uh, 5K this weekend? Sure. So at 9 o'clock, um, the gun fires off um, at EMC Park on Hayden Row in Hopkinton. Uh, it's a race and walk, so uh, everybody can participate. We've got lots of baby carriages being pushed through the event. Um, there'll be a 5K that runs through a very selected route through Hopkinton. Um, that was important to a, a bunch of the people who founded the organization. And we'll finish back up behind the middle school in Hopkinton, and then we'll go on for a couple hours of uh, some fun food, some bands, and uh, we'll finish up just before noon tomorrow. Absolutely. On Saturday, sorry, on oh, okay. Saturday. And, and it's fun for the whole family here. I was there last year, it was just packed, and everyone seems to really enjoy uh, all the events throughout the day for certainly a great cause. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think um, we will be somewhere just over 500 people. Uh, not all of those are in the race, but uh, we hope to have another uh, good year on Saturday. All right, so the race, that it'll start up at 9 a.m.? 9 a.m. is uh, correct. All right, 9 a.m., so get there early because streets, are, I'm sure, are going to be crowded. A couple streets will close for a little bit, so you sh uh, certainly want to get there a little bit early uh, before 9 a.m. Where's the start line? So the start line is on the main entrance to EMC, the driveway as you move into the park, so we'll mm -hmm. go off there, and the actual finish line will be behind the, uh, the high school. Um, on the Loop Road. So Pat, can you tell us uh, about where the funding is going uh, for this race and, and what it will help support, what programs? There are a number of programs that we do. Uh, my favorite and the one closest and dearest to my heart is the uh, dinners we do at Yawkey House at Children's Hospital where we provide dinners uh, f uh, for folks who are staying there as well as patients. Uh, they come from literally all over the world. We've met folks from Panama, China, uh, Uzbekistan and just incredible. Boston is the mecca for children. It's the best children's hospital in the world. And our long term goal is to build a house similar to Yawkey House at Children's Hospital named Evans Way, named in obviously in memory of Evan for pediatric cardiac patients, which unfortunately Evan was and what he succumbed to was uh, some cardiac disease in his early 20s. Uh, we'll also, we're also doing EK, EKG screenings. We're doing one. Uh, they did one yesterday at Medfield, tomorrow, Thursday at Holliston, and then Friday at Hopkinton High, which we've gotten great support from the high school administration. Uh, we'll, we also fund scholarships for uh, those uh, students at Hopkinton High who embody uh, what Evan was all about. Uh, we also do backpack programs at the hospital for you know, like toiletries and stuff like that when you're rushing your child to a you know, major medical center. The last thing on your mind is some of the small stuff, so we try and provide that for as well. And it's uh, really started, and uh, you know, Mr. Girardi obviously is the backbone of the organization, but it's friends of Evan from uh, the class of 2007 at Hopkinton High and, and others, and they're really the, uh, the dreamers. Uh, there's a couple of us old folks that are trying to help put some structure to it, but the dreamers and the guys who are on the ground doing the work, and I'm so proud to be associated with them. Well, it's certainly a terrific program, and uh, the uh, funding will help support a number of uh, great causes uh, within the program. So certainly look forward to that. That's the Live for Evan 5K this Saturday, 9 a.m. is the start time. Make sure you reserve your spot early.